And we're live. It's Adam Robinson, founder and CEO of Retention.com. Shopify stores have no idea how effective Retention.com is for growing email lists. It literally works 10 to 15 times better than the next best option out there, which is trying to capture a form fill. Um, here is our process for email list growth that we used to double Bruce Bolt's list size in the first 40 days while solving a delivery issue they had with Clavio, net improving their deliverability and growing their product views by 25%. We named it the Bruce Bolt implementation because Chris Hall at Bruce Bolt was the pioneer that worked with us to come up with this implementation. It is an in innovative solution that grows your email list at the speed of light and is safer than applesauce. So here was the problem. The original welcome series, which we have observed happen over the years in some cases, uh, with our emails had high, very high positive engagement, but also had high negative engagement. This typically isn't a problem because it's such a small percentage of the overall email flow that's going out. But if you're sending a welcome series, it just hurts to see those numbers. So what is the solution? The solution is da -da 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 -da, the Bruce Bolt implementation. What is the Bruce Bolt implementation? Well, when we get new contacts from your website and we're about to put them in a welcome series, instead of doing that, we hold them in a segment and we send them with a large newsletter instead of on their own in a welcome series first. What happens is the negative engagement gets lost in the much larger newsletter send because we're only providing, let's say 1% of the newsletter send as net new contacts. So that was a bunch of mumbo jumbo. Let's look at the numbers. On its own, this was the problem. So on its own, this was the problem. Retention.com contacts, we were putting 500 to 1,000 in per day in the Clavio Welcome Series. The complaint rate was 0.48. It needs to be above 0.1, probably 0 0.05. And then the unsub rate was 3.56%. That in a flow looks like garbage. Clavio is going to tell you stop doing whatever you're doing. However, with the new implementation, this is what their old newsletter used to look like. So that's the spam rate, incredibly low. That's the size, 136K. And the unsubs, 0.2%. Uh, and then these were the active on-site and page views, all right? With the Bruce Bolt implementation, look what happened. Email list growth, tremendous. This was like the first two weeks. And as you can see, the spam rate and the unsubscribe rate are not increased in a meaningful way that causes any concern whatsoever. Um, you can see mathematically why this is a safe strategy to pursue. Uh, and I want to highlight the number of product views, which is what matters for everybody at the end of the day anyway. Um, they grew from 2.3K to 4K. That's almost 100% growth with not as much uh, list size growth. So... Um, Look, follow me if you want to see me build a unicorn in public. That is the Bruce Bolt implementation uh, signing up.